This breaks every curse. This removes everything that stood against you to limit you. This removes everything. Poverty wouldn't dare to talk about you today. Limitation wouldn't dare to talk about you today. Those thoughts of miscarriage wouldn't dare to give you thoughts. That lack of promotion wouldn't dare to bind you and to block you. I declare today that marital failure wouldn't dare to cause you to fail. I speak today, I'm saying none, none would dare to speak against you. I'm saying how oh, you're ruling. You are ruling amongst your enemies. Your colleagues who are against you wouldn't dare now to plot against you. Those who plotted witchcraft against you, witchcraft would disappoint those who brought witchcraft against you because witchcraft wouldn't dare to bewitch you now. Every mouth that speaks against you today wouldn't dare to speak about you. Sicknesses and diseases wouldn't dare to plan pains against you, to plan death against you. Your adversaries wouldn't dare to speak about you today. Poverty wouldn't dare to speak against you. It shall be manifested through your relatives, through everyone looking at you. Is this the one who was poor? Is this the one who didn't have? Is this the one who was begging? Is this the one whom we refuse to give money? Why does it seem that he's the one to provide for us? Poverty wouldn't dare to speak against you. For from now on, the spirit of truth, the blood speaking a better message speaks for you. If the blood speaks a better message for you, who will speak against the message of the blood? Who will speak against the blood that you drink, spiritual drink that came from spiritual rock? And all those enemies wouldn't dare to speak against Israel. For this is what the Lord is doing against your enemies. Air commanders, put your feet on the neck of your enemies because this is what the Lord will do. The Lord has done it. He's seated on the right hand of God now. The Lord has given you the spirit of truth, the spirit of life, the spirit of honor. You are seated on the place of honor, commanders. Hey, commanders, command, command the pains to go, command sicknesses to go. They wouldn't dare to speak against your body. They wouldn't dare to speak against your future. That which stands against your business wouldn't dare to speak against your business from today. That which speaks against your marriage will never, never, ever, they wouldn't dare to speak against your marriage. The springs are opened. Springs of heaven are opened. Flooding and removing enemies. For you ruled. As you receive the word, it happens right now. You rule amongst enemies now. Look at your enemies. Look at your enemies. Look at them coming out. Cancer living you. Cancer leaves you. Hey, bacteria are living you. Hey, look at fibroids living you. Look at those cysts going out of your life. Look at that poison coming out of your body. Look at the spirit speaks. It's not medical instruments. It's not medical equipment. But it's the way the spirit speaking right now. Look at that poison escaping your body. It wouldn't dare to speak against you anymore. It wouldn't dare to block your children. It wouldn't dare to block your pregnancy. It wouldn't dare. Look at that poison. Look at that poison. Hey, that poison is coming out. Look at that poison coming out. Look at that poison leaving your body. It's not a medical instrument. Look at that poison. But the spirit comes. The hand of the law of the word comes into your body, removing poison. It comes out easily. It comes out. There's poison coming out. There's poison coming out. There's poison coming out. Poison 
given spiritually in a dream, poison given by your enemies, there it comes out. It doesn't need anything. You are to feed and take care of them. With the word, light comes. That poison comes out. That poison comes out. It wouldn't dare to speak against you anymore. It wouldn't speak against you giving you barrenness. It wouldn't dare to speak against you giving you poverty. It wouldn't dare to speak against you giving headaches. That poison that gives you sicknesses, that gives you disease. Look, it's the hand of the Lord. He doesn't need medical instruments. He doesn't need medication. That wouldn't dare to speak against you. That eye problem, the root cause of your eyes, eye problems, that will never speak against you anymore. They wouldn't dare. They will never dare to speak against you. They will never dare. The spirit of a place of honor has come. Braskar kosh tester ye. Gear, 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 gear. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Leave their eyes. Leave their womb. Leave their stomach, leave their chest, leave their back, leave their knees, leave their bones, leave their elbows, leave their body joints. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! The spirit of truth who exposes everything that speaks. They wouldn't dare to speak against you today. They won't dare to speak against your future. They won't dare to speak about you. Uh, they won't dare to speak against your tomorrow. They won't dare to speak about your marriage. They won't dare to speak about your promotion. Here is it. These evil forces have been speaking against your promotions. This evil force... Today, the spirit of truth locates each and every one of you watching right now. The feet of our king, the commander who commanded the commanders. Those feet are on the neck of every enemy, every poverty, every sickness, every barrenness, every headache, every, every allergy, every cancer, every sinus, every mom's, all the mom's. I declare now. Raspe Kratos Kre, Rastum Radish to Rusty Ray Ilende Yete, Christo Stabrata Straketosto, Prosor Yeti, Leclo Samando Sotisa Kita Rita, Bostorinde Elechla, Kisto Mandro Zosera, Aschito Starte Carpu Pracayo, Amino Miss, revealing the mystery of this word, revealing the mystery that's given. I am the truth has come. I am. I am the truth that has come. I am the reality that has been spoken about. I'm in your midst. I'm in your midst. I'm in your midst. Those cones on your legs, those cones on your feet, wouldn't dare to speak against your movement. You will walk properly. Those cones on your feet, those cones on your feet, wouldn't dare to speak against you. The body joints. Wouldn't dare to speak against your body, making you weak. They won't dare to speak today. They won't dare to speak. Those silences won't dare to speak. We silence every mouth that speaks against your future. The promise, the spirit of honor has come. The promise, the spirit of honor has come. The root cause of your eyes. That root cause won't dare to speak now. It won't dare to speak against your eyes. Those eyeballs find rest. Those body joints find rest. That stomach pain finds rest. That womb finds rest. That back finds rest. Your bones find rest. That spike finds rest. Your spinal cord finds rest. I need the rest. The rest. That spinal cord finds rest. Finds rest. For the spirit of truth has come. The spirit that gives you rest has come. That neck pain. That neck pain won't dare to speak against you. That neck pain won't dare to speak against you. That depression won't dare to speak against you. Wouldn't dare to speak out. You're watching right now. Even those who are sleeping, you're watching right now. Whether you're awake or you're asleep, there's a spirit of truth that locates people who are sleeping. 
people who are sick in the hospitals are with appearances, even though you are not watching me, wherever you are, here am I. The commander, the commander has come, Jesus Christ. I put my feet on the neck of every enemy of yours. I put my feet on the neck of every enemy of yours. Every demon, lie down. Expose your neck. In the name of Jesus Christ, on your necks, on your necks, on the necks, I walk on every neck, every neck, every neck of every demon that stood against you. Neck of every demon standing against you. My feet on the necks. My feet on the necks. If the commander Satan has commanded you and called you a commander, your demons will remove you from the rank by stepping on your neck. The devil who has here the dragon, I step on your neck. I step on your neck. You move aside. You leave the people of God alone. You move aside. You leave the people of God alone. You move aside. You leave the people of God alone. Miscarriages will no longer speak. Miscarriages will no longer speak. Miscarriages wouldn't dare to speak against the womb. Blessed are you, O oh mother. Blessed are you, O oh womb. Miscarriages will never take place. Miscarriages will never speak. Rasi halando yedo skre. Please to sta bre. Gesto sta. It's time that you can know now that I walk in your body. I walk in your body to silence every enemy. I walk in your body to silence every enemy in your body. I walk in your body now. Ectopic pregnancy, you will no longer speak. Ectopic pregnancy, you will no longer speak against that kind of fertility that is introduced now into the body. Ectopic pregnancy, you will no longer speak now. Prashi, Halloi. Ali, that's an operation happening in your womb now. A topic pregnancy, eh, shh, silent, be quiet. They won't dare to speak against that womb. All types of topics, never, never, will never ever speak. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, spirit of poverty, shut up. Spirit of poverty, shut up. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Even of ancestral worship, shut up. Ancestral worship shall no longer speak in your family. Ancestral worship shall no longer speak. Traditional worship shall no longer speak. Herbalist worship shall no longer speak. That which has been speaking in your family shall no longer speak. It has hindered you for far too long now. The Lord has stepped in. The commander from above, our Lord Jesus Christ, has stepped in. His feet is on the neck of every ancestral worship all ancestral worships now all ancestral worship we silence your mouth all ancestral worships all ancestral worships all ancestral worship quickly quickly you depart shut up shut up shut up shut up out of the children out of their parents out of their husbands out of their wives out of their family out of their marriages out of their business out of their success out of the business get out get out Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Ancestral worship! Ancestral worship! You mood is put inside their bodies through cuts. You mood is put inside their bodies through cutting them. You will no longer speak those cuts. You will never speak anymore. You will never speak against the success. Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Hey, ancestral worship. Praso pre in the kita kita kita. Crostombri elechra tu stebri Jesus yaliyadu. There's a time which you heard about, and the time has come. You no longer speak. Your ancestral worship. You no longer speak in their lives. You no longer speak in their wombs. You no longer speak in their stomachs. You no longer speak in their chest. You no longer speak in their families. You no longer speak. Hey, shut up! Shut up! Get out! Shut up! And do not shut your mouth! Get out! Shut up! Get out! Shut up! Get out! Shut up! Get out! 
Get out, ancestral spirits. Get out. Get out, you unclean spirits. Unclean spirits. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. out of their bodies. Out of their cupboards in their bedrooms. Out of their cupboards in their bedrooms. You multis, get out of their cupboards. You come out of their cupboards, out of their grocery cupboards, out of their kitchens. You come out. You come out of their kitchens. You come out of their yards. You come out of the house. Wherever you've been placed, you will no longer speak. You will no longer speak. You won't dare to speak. Fulfillment has come. Light has now been revealed. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. You will no longer speak ancestral spirits. 